Meet Hive, a compact project management software for teamwork optimization. So what is Hive? Hive was founded in 2015. As every software has been evolving ever since and Hive team works every day on the software's development. Hive is built by the users for the users and it's being improved based on customer feedback and their needs. The team's goal is to improve workplace productivity for companies of all types and sizes. Hive is a project management and collaboration software for anybody who needs a centralized workflow management system that can help them operate and understand their team and different processes that are an integral part of the company's activity. The software has two pricing plans. Professional plan starting at $12 per user per month. This comes with the most essential features like unlimited projects and messages, standard integrations, desktop mobile apps, etc. And the second plan is enterprise plan, which is tailored individually to the company's needs. Here you get all the features of professional and rollout support, custom integrations, Hive analytics, Hive analytics upgrades, and many more. So how to use Hive? If you're familiar with software such as Asana, Basecamp or Trello, you will find it easy to use Hive, but let's see how it looks like, what it offers and what you can do with all these features. Setting up the account is always easy and looks almost the same for every software. In Hive there are 8 steps you need to go through. You can sign in with Google, Slack or the traditional way using an email address. Then you create a workspace and add the name of your organization and its size. The next step is to add example projects. You can choose from different templates like content calendar, new hire onboarding product roadmap and a few more. Then you choose how you'd like to message your team. You can use Hive Messaging or the app you and your team are already using. Afterwards you create your first project. You write three actions that will be added to your project. You invite your colleagues and connect your file, file storage to Hive like Google Drive, Box, Dropbox or OneDrive depending on the one you're currently using. So now that you have your account set up, you can start using Hive. So at first, Hive may seem a little complicated with all the windows, tabs and details. But to make it easier, Hive provides you with a guided checklist, Hive Mastery, to help you understand how everything works. You can follow the checklist at the start of using Hive or do it in the process. The items will check off the list automatically. Let's focus on the main view. From this level you can access everything, which is particularly helpful if you don't like switching between all the tabs and windows. There are five joint components. Messaging panel, which provides you access to group conversations or direct messages. Messaging board, for a conversation with selected group. Project panel, providing you with the overview of all the projects. Your board. Here you can view the project or summary view that you have chosen. You can also check out your My Actions list that shows all the actions that are assigned to you. And the top panel with all the features accessible in one place. So all of that makes Hive a compact project management software. You have access to everything in just one place without the need of switching between many different levels as it is in most of the tools of this type. So that's the general overview of Hive. Now let's look into each panel and each component and how it can help your business grow. Messaging panel. This panel is where you can access everything related to your messaging. It's really easy to use and looks like a simplified version of Slack's panel with all the groups and team members. Here's what you can do in the messaging panel. You can set your status, create new groups, of course message all your team members and invite new team members via email. You can also send an email invitation to groups and projects. Messaging board. Messaging board is connected to messaging panel. You can keep it visible or hide it to have more space for project panel and your board. 
This board shows the private or group conversations you select. Similarly to Slack, you can add reactions to messages, share files and invite people. You can also turn notifications on and off, edit and delete groups. But the real fun is the ability to turn part of your conversation into a task with a drag and drop feature. Messaging board and messaging panel are simple and intuitive and they help to maintain effective communication. Project panel. Now here's where all the big stuff happens. This panel gives you a detailed insight into all projects and tasks. While being able to access everything from one level is great, at first I find it quite difficult to navigate through this panel in Hive. There are so many details that I don't know what to start from. But let's go through it step by step. My advice is to hide the messaging board and focus only on the project panel to get a better overview of the projects, tasks and features. There are four sections with different types of projects which categorize every project based on its stage. Now car with current projects, future with snoozed projects, completed and assigned to me projects which you can delegate to other people. To every project you can add as many tasks and actions as you want. Additionally, tasks have many practical sub-features like description, sub-actions, date, status, type of template, comments and many more. These features help to take control over every detail of project and make sure there are no mistakes. Moreover, in project panel above the list of projects, there are four icons. The first one is the list view, which is the main view of the list by default with all your projects. The second one is the Kanban view. And the Kanban view allows you to outline your projects in the ways as you need. It can either be super detailed with many phases or as simple as two or three phases. You can juggle it all as you want. In the Kanban view, you can filter the actions by time category. Today, this week, this month, overdue, no due date or none. And in the last one, you can sort actions by due date, priority and last updated, group by project name or none, and export to PNG. What needs to be done section is a fast way of adding another section whenever you have anything to be added to your project. To sum up, project panel is the most important part of Hive project management software. It's the main dashboard for all the activities of your team, where you can see everything at a glance. It will let you manage your projects within your team very easily and report and monitor progress, share updates with your team. Your board. This panel has three important parts. They are visible on the white bar above the project panel. The first part is Project Navigator, the place where you can easily access all your projects. There are four categories of projects, active projects, archived projects, summary views and templates. In Project Navigator you have a list of projects with their names and team members who participate. You can also add people, add new project and pin or unpin it from the bar. New project can be created from scratch or you can copy it from the existing templates. Adding new project has three steps. Choosing project name, its color, dates, labels, description, attachments, parent projects and phases. Setting privacy. Setting it to private or for specific people or everyone in your team. And choosing project layout like the status view, team view, calendar, label view, Gantt view, table view, the one which suits your current project the most. Summary views section allows you to see actions from more than one project at the same time. The next part of project panel is my actions. It displays all your projects, which I described in part four project panel. Next to my actions, you have all your projects. You can quickly find them by their names and colors and add new ones. It's worth to take a look at this section Note that if you unpin your product from the bar, you won't be able to see or access it here. And so by accessing the project from this area, you can see everything about it, including all the previously mentioned features. You can also create custom fields as you need. The top panel. So let's see what information you can get in the Hive's top panel available in the top of Hive's project management software. 
First of all, if you need any help, there's the big question mark on the right top where you can find answers to your questions about the software, tips and tricks. Then you can access the most basic settings, like My Profile, where you can update information about you, Workspace, where you can manage all the features of your workspace, including appearance, team members, labels or templates. Adding actions, like import tasks from Trello, Asana Basecamp or simply a CSV file. Enable apps, for example, time tracking, resourcing, forms, messaging or dependencies. Analytics, which provides you with a detailed insight into your team's performance, such as productivity, projects completed, etc. And sign up for a paid subscription. There's also Files panel where you can see all the latest files from your file storage. That's convenient if you use Virtual Drive. For notifications, there's a bell icon so you can be sure you are always up to date with all the projects. The next two items allow you to invite your team members and add new action for your team. Top panel is also where the time tracker is located, so you can see how much time you're spending on tasks. So how can Hive actually help your business? It will let you create a centralized system of communication and collaboration, where everyone can see what's happening in the organization, stay updated with the latest changes, and adjust their work to what's happening around. There are many great apps aimed at optimizing work, but using different tools for communication, collaboration, tasks, and project management might be not a preferable option for some companies. So Hive enables you to have it all in one place. Hive is also an excellent solution for teams who work on complex projects divided into many tasks. You can quickly organize every action and attribute different preferences to it, like SME, date, budget, files, etc. It will also let you visualize projects thanks to multiple projects layouts, like Kanban view, Gantt charts, calendar, and others. So altogether, Hive creates a unified system which allows you to monitor your team's work in one place without the need of switching between different apps. Hive is a very condensed project management and collaboration software which allows you to access all the information about your team and their work conveniently. Hive will help you automate work and optimize processes related to communication and collaboration, tasks and project management. If you think about it, Hive really is a hive where all the busy bees meet to discuss their commitments, take a look at the progress of work and contribute to creation of something meaningful. Hive is where work happens. Compared to other project management software, Hive looks really great. It's innovative and fancy software. The major drawback of Hive software is that to fully discover everything it offers, you should go through the help section as not everything is clear right after you start using the app. With all its features like unlimited projects, time tracking, different layouts, native messaging, it's a really advanced project management software. And there are more features to come, like proofreading and approvals, forms with dynamic fields and project landing pages. Let us know what you think about Hive in the comments and subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with new reviews and materials coming to PixSAS.